Hey gang, Airborne Sapper comic fan is having a contest where you can create your own con. You can basically have anyone you want. I've been loving the other entries, and Rob Harris did one where he made a big deal about having an unlimited budget. I'm going to make a big deal about having necromancer powers. So my con will be called Judging the Living and the Dead Con. For my headliners, I'd resurrect Gil Kane and Jack Kirby. Kirby would be sitting there sketching, a cigar in his mouth, a carpenter's pencil in his hand. Can I draw you a Captain America, son? Well, yes, Mr. Kirby. Go over to Gil Kane. My boy, these markers are archival. Give me something that'll turn purple in 10 years. Yes, Mr. Kane. For my living artists, I would have Steve Ditko, hopefully talking about the creation of Spider-Man instead of objectivism. I'd have Adam Hughes, not because of peer pressure, but because I actually do love Adam Hughes. The fingerprints on this copy of comic book artists should attest to that. And I would have Robert Crumb, sketching like he is in this photo. I was invited to go to this, but I was living with my head up my ass, so I missed the opportunity. Um, this was taken in New Paltz, New York in 2000. This is a conference room, and there's maybe at most 50 kids in there. To show off the drawing, he hands off the sketchbook and they pass it around, and I'm like, God damn it, why didn't I go? For the movie, I would want the cast of Private Parts. You could get Howard, Robin, Fred, Gary Baba Bowie Delabate, Jackie can come, but he's not allowed to promote. But you could also get ACDC, Jenna Jameson, and if I can resurrect him, Crackhead Bob. For the TV show, I would want the cast of The Larry Sanders Show. This is actually the precursor to The Larry Sanders Show. Uh, I'd have to resurrect Gary Shandling, but you'd have Rip Torn, Jeffrey Tambor, Scott Thompson, but you could get all the guest stars. So you get Beck, uh, Winona Ryder, Colin Quinn, David Spade, Wu-Tang Clan, Michael Bolton, basically the list goes on and on. For the wrestlers, I'm going to have to cheat a little because you didn't state dead or alive, but I'm an old, old man. I haven't paid attention to wrestling since Tugboat became Typhoon. The betrayal. But genuinely, I still get weirded out when I hear someone say WWE instead of WWF. I'm like, huh? Oh yeah, right. So. My wrestlers would be um, Macho Man Randy Savage, The Ultimate Warrior, not Warrior, The Ultimate Warrior, and uh, Rowdy Roddy Piper, and I'd ask him about They Live. For the exclusive pops, I would go with Cops Pops, not just because it sounds funny, but because I think the designs actually lend themselves very well to the pops template. And I'd resurrect Barry White as my musical guest. He would sing, Damn, I Wish I Was Your Lover, and I'd ask him, why didn't you do that when you were alive? Was it too on the nose? But anyway, um, thank you to Airborne Sapper comic fan for holding this contest. Uh, congratulations on the two hundy. I've got your link in the description. I've got the links to everyone you've suggested we subscribe to in the description. Uh, I love all the entries I've seen so far. Uh, so thank you for watching.